Lagos Transport Fest held an event in Lagos yesterday with focus on road, hair, and maritime transport sectors. The event was attended by industry experts, leaders, and government officials with focus on the potentials in the Nigerian transport market as well as preferred solutions to these attendance challenges. The Commissioner of Transport, Frederick Abimbola Oladende, who was present at the event, mentioned the plans government has in place to tackle the challenges in the transport sector. The government is developing a policy. Government already has a strategic transport master plan. Government is thinking of driving um, the, the, the master plan with technology and the solution to our problem is developing options, developing a public transport system that is affordable, that is attractive, that is efficient, that is effective. And that is what government will do. During the plenary session, panelists shared their perspectives on the future of mobility in Lagos State and ways to make transportation more convenient. Infrastructure first, and then technology powering the different models in the ecosystem. That basically is key for me. I like the idea of mass movement, but if you say, if you look at where we're coming from already, we need to actually start small and go strategically. From the community point of view, it's important that I can basically track my track from where I want to start and where I want to go. And whether that is starting the first part of my trip into the motorbike and make it onto a bus or get onto a ferry. Uh, or a tram or a train for me for that matter is actually material. It's all about giving the community first that information so that they can know. We need to find a way of moving masses of numbers, large number of volumes of communities. And the only way we can then implement technology is to make it difficult for those of us who drive a car, one of us a car, to make it difficult for those users of the road by implementing things like tolling, etc. The Commission of Transportation further shed light on their collaboration with Nigerian police to tackle other traffic issues in the state. Recently, the governor of Lagos State um, collaborated with the um, police, where the police um, agreed to give us a, a thousand of their men. And uh, you can see them deployed at um, every junction um, just to ensure that people are safe. Uh, apart from uh, making, I mean, making traffic flow, um, they're also pr uh, protecting the uh, travelers. So we've deployed more um, police, and uh, we have more last mile on the road, and then we have more enforcement agents. I mean, agencies working collaboratively. The idea behind Lagos Transport Fest is to create a platform that is bringing together public and private sector collaboration for them to have fireside conversations that is going to focus on developing the transport sector. A call for more collaboration between public and private sector was made in order to attain a sustainable and equitable transport system in the state. Mercy Emmanuel for Plus TV Africa.